when we um, even use the word, you know, hate, we give someone the power uh, over us when we uh, say that we hate them or even say in our heads and think about how much we hate or dislike somebody. Um, it gives other the other person uh, the power because you're taking up that space in your head and the energy and it's bring, and it brings you down whether we know it or not it does uh, it brings us down uh, we, we don't know at the time I mean I used to do the same thing I used to think about you know angry you know at lo over loved ones relationships or whatever and uh, hold on to uh, old resentment thoughts and anger and say the word hate too much um, the successful people in this life they uh, some of the stuff that they have above a lot of us the stuff that I'm trying to uh, teach you now is um, it's the reason why a lot of them meditate and stuff is uh, letting go of past trauma issues I, I know they're not so easy it's difficult I mean not you know it's hard when it comes to like you know uh, you know some of the stuff you get to work with professionals and stuff but if you're holding on to old resentment and anger towards the loved ones and or any you know, someone that's in it's gonna bring you down and make you feel more sad and depressed and make you feel more uh, you know inner not it's gonna take away your inner joy and love for life um, it doesn't matter how old we are if we're uh, you know 20 30 40 50 60 70 it's never too late to start enjoying and living life and loving life um, before financial freedom and success we have to be comfortable in our own bodies and skin. We have to get more aligned with ourselves and the universe. The laws of attraction. Um, that all applies to how the vibes that we're that we're putting out in the universe. Um, you know how we can pick up on negative vibes and how some people are are very nice to be around around because they're positive vibes love for life and all that you want to you want to try to surround yourself with with positive people and positive things and and try to not use the word hate um, now I don't use the word hate I use the word dislike is the strongest word I'll use and um, and the worst things we can do is judge ourselves and others I used to do it all the time but until I learned how much it took away from my own self and, uh, you know, my love for life. If we wake up and we say to ourselves and our subconscious that today is going to suck. Well, today will suck if we think that way. But if we wake up and we say, you know what, today is going to be a great day. I'm going to go out and enjoy myself. Um, live life to the fullest, do what I want, not let anybody hold me back, uh, then you're going to have a great day. And, you know, the universe, everyone, and the laws of attraction, it all lines up. And you'll find your happiness uh, through more positive thinking and being more aware of the negative thoughts that uh, manifest up in your head. The quicker you drop the negative thoughts and... Um, the anger towards others, even if you get cut off in traffic, um, just brush it off, let it go, because it's not worth letting others affect your day and your life. We only get one life, but we get a lot of chances to live uh, and, get, and, and build abundance and success. And the only uh, thing that holds us back is our, old th is our own old stinking thinking and minds. Um, everyone's equal. We all have a chance to live in prosperity and to have a happy life. And um, as soon as we learn to get more out of our heads and get with the living and get out, get off uh, our old habits, the better things the better things are. You know, when you uh, have a great day and you're feeling, you know, uh, like everything is going right. Everything seems to work out perfectly, right? You seem to run into people that, you know, are doing great too. Um, or um, see if you're if you're sad or lonely, 
say if you want a girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever, if you start practicing these principles on being like uh, more abundant, being happier, keeping negative thoughts out of your head, you're going to attract uh, better people in your life and probably your love of your life. Um, because people pick up on fives and frequencies. So if you have, if your heart is open, that's how I go around now, open to people and love, you're going to find happiness and more love in life and success. The biggest thing is being more is to be for success is to be happy in our own shoes and feel abundant first, and not be and to get and to work on our insecurities. Then comes the success in life as for you know financially and stuff. We need to do stuff. People, all of us need to stop thinking, obsessing over money. Money comes after um, we are able to. Uh, get rid of the problems in our head and get more comfortable in our own skin and start feeling happier. And that then the laws of attraction will fall in place and w everything will align in the universe. Um, even our pets pick up on our frequencies. If someone is a negative person and is always mad, uh, their dog's probably a nervous wreck and barks a lot. But if you're positive, people are going to pick it up. So if you just practice and work on being more aware of your thoughts, especially negative ones or past emotions and thoughts, you're going to start creating wealth and abundance. Um, if you want to, but we need to. The major thing is to stop obsessing about money. Um, that's not. Uh, no one's ever died wishing they made more money, um, but they've. A lot of people have gone through life wishing they spent more time with uh, with. Uh, loved ones and enjoying life uh, and the things that life has to offer and as soon as you start doing that you're going to start feeling more abundant and you're going to start feeling more aligned with the universe and you're going to start feeling more love and people around you are going to feel that and respond to that and things are going to go from there you're going to things are going to just keep getting better and better so if you're stuck in your head and you're having a hard time whatever I want you to know, feel free to write to me. Uh, I love, you know, answering. Um, I'm thrilled with all the feedback I've been getting. This is what makes me uh, keep doing these videos. I love uh, the idea of helping people or inspiring people. Um, it's great. Um, I'm still working on myself and I'm here to help you work on yourself. Um, again, um, if you're able to get uh, it's a small it's a, it's the, the beginning is being able to if you, it's a big step if you're able to drop negative a negative thought or emotion out of your head that's a win for you like say if you worked on that after you watched the video and you were thinking negative if you're able to forget about thinking that way and drop it out of your mind and start thinking in the present and not worrying about past emotions and if you start learning, learning the process of how powerful forgiveness is and forgiving others and when other people apologize to you, it's very powerful. Um, when you start doing that, everything will start aligning better and happiness will follow you. And then success and money. Um, please subscribe if you uh, can. Uh, write to me, DerekNickerson34 at gmail.com or comment. Um, again. Uh, if you write to me, it stays between me and you. I don't care what it is. I love to help. Um, everyone have a great day. Um, keep your head up and uh, just be aware of the negative thoughts.